Be making basics. What's going on YouTube? Beat Making Basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe because I'm coming back to back with bangers. Today's video, we're going to continue the Logic Pro 10.8 update, um, but I wanted to cover how we can make some dope samples, some crazy samples using this new update. So what we're going to do is I'm actually just going to start off with a software instrument track. We're going to go to MIDI right here, and then I'm going to go actually with... Uh, was one of the sounds from Alchemy. So I'm not going to use any third party sounds or whatever. Um, but yeah, we're going to do that. And then I'm just going to find some type of sound that will, you know, actually, let's see if we can find like a synth or something like that. Let me see. Go to synths. Push musical typing, command K. So the first thing I'm going to do is just get inspired, find something that inspires me. Um, and I'm going to stick with doing something in a minor key. So I'm going to do something simple like that. Let me see. Takes us up to 130 something. There you go. Simple, simple, simple. Um, I don't know why I didn't get this last one. All right, cool. So we got this first one. I used to, I like to use a technique called layering. And it's basically, I'm just gonna take this same pattern. We'll just double it and then I'm gonna change the sound here. So we're gonna do that. See, we get a piano sound or something, keys. Let me do that one more time, and then I'm gonna do a counter melody, and then we'll really get into the whole aspect of sampling and cooking up something crazy with the new update. Um, get organ here. has a lot of reverb and everything but we're gonna still roll with this now like I said I'm gonna do a counter melody um, let me see if I can find like maybe some bells I'll just type it in here So that's our counter melody. I'm gonna do this one more time and I'm gonna take this upper octave. I'll just put a shift option and up. So now what I do 
is I'm just going to double this up by pushing Command R. And then I'm going to highlight everything. And then I'm just going to bounce this in place. Um, obviously, I can also come over here and maybe do some basic like mixing, maybe pat, uh, pan some of this stuff. You feel me? I'm gonna pan it, and then I'm just gonna bounce this in place like this, and it's gonna take it, uh, or turn it into like a, a solid sample here. Now that we have this solid sample, let me just play it. Now what I could do is I could take this and we could put it into some of the stuff that we have in the update. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna go ahead and grab this uh, beat great uh, breaker. So if you go down to multi effects and go to beat breakers the first one after you get the update this one right here has a lot of different things we could do to this so i can turn it to halftime and that's pretty hard actually uh what am i actually gonna do <laughs> i'm gonna make a double i'm gonna double that one i'm gonna keep this one right here because this is gonna turn into a, a beat at this point um, I'm gonna go to custom. So we have this one that's going on halftime, slowed up. That could be like one little cool little part in a in the beat. And then I have this one. Then I'm gonna do some like little tricks too. So I'm gonna I wanna have like a little repeat thing going right here. Actually, I wanna do it right here. Then we can also move the timing. So I like how it sounded right there. And then what I'm gonna do to make it sound a little smoother is go to volume and turn that down just a little bit. So now that I have that going, next thing I'm going to do is take this and I'm going to drag it over here to sample alchemy. Okay. Not quick sampler or any of these. It's sample alchemy. That's the newest sampler. Boom. Now it's in sample alchemy. Um, let me push command K to pull back this, uh, pull this back up. And now I can do some cool stuff with this. So we got that gran granular additive. I think I like the spectral. So I don't know why it like clipped that part right there, but we can go to trim right here and we can grab, grab it from here. So now this, this sample is trimmed, and now I can maybe come over here and add some points. Cool thing, we can come over here and mix this.
so that turned out pretty dope. Now I'm going to lay this down. So now we have this hard sample that we created from scratch using Logic Pro 10.8's latest update. Man, make sure you get subscribed because we cover back to back with bangers. Like I said, we also have some dope courses and sound kits and melody kits and stuff like that that you can grab from my website, beatmakingbasis.com. Make sure you go ahead and head over there, man, because we do got some specials going and we got some amazing content for you that's exclusive, not on YouTube. Anyway, um, make sure you stay tuned for the next video. The next video, I'm going to be going over some beat arrangement. I'm going to take this beat or this sample right here and we're going to cook up, a, cook up a hard beat as well. Uh, you know, right here in Logic Pro 10, man. But anyway, appreciate your watching. I will see you in the next level or next video. I'll let you listen to this sample one more time.